These are the adventures of the Swana superheroes, coming to you from their secret headquarters located behind a hidden door in the Swana offices. Their mission, to combat threats against humanity by helping Swana members develop solutions for critical waste management issues. The heroes know Swana members and their partners feel concern for the future of our planet and will step forward to show the world how to transform waste into a valuable resource. Today's episode, New York City's Waste Conversion Technology Pilot, is the technology ripe enough for the Big Apple? Part 2 In part one of our story, the superheroes were concerned with a problem concerning where to put all the waste that New York City residents create. Were they able to help residents be more sustainable with their waste disposal options? Let's find out! Calling Valerie now. As a valued member of the SWANA team, she helps with many aspects of WasteCon. She might know someone who's doing a presentation about New York City's waste management problems. I wonder if Valerie would like to join the superheroes. Hello, Valerie. The SWANA superheroes have heard about the problems New York City is having with waste disposal. Do you know whether any citizens will be offering solutions to help reduce landfill greenhouse gases and waste transportation emissions as a part of their waste con presentation? Well, I know there are two people who are offering a presentation about this at WasteCon, Sarah Dolinar and Susan Rayla. Sarah is with the New York City Department of Sanitation, and Susan works for HDR. They will talk about the desire of the most populous city in America to develop projects which demonstrate the feasibility of alternative solid waste management technology using MSW as a feedstock as part of an overall ambitious waste management plan. The plan provides a waste export system that relies on remote conventional disposal options while demonstrating technologies that can be sited close to home to take MSW straight from the truck and turn it into energy for New York City. It sounded very interesting. I can give you an overview if you like. The Big Apple generates about 30,000 tons of waste and recyclables each day and about 11,000 tons of that is MSW generated by households and institutions and managed by the New York City Department of Sanitation. After its last disposal facility, Fresh Kills Landfill, closed in 2001, the city crafted a new solid waste management plan. Through that plan, which took effect in 2006, the city is building new marine transfer facilities, replacing long-haul waste trucking with barge and rail export, and exploring new alternative technologies for waste treatment and disposal in or near the city to help make a greener and greater New York. New marine facilities are already being ready for operation and more are under construction. And there are still many developments to come, including this new alternative technology program. But to find out any more, people just have to attend Sarah and Susan's WasteCon presentation. That sounds great, Valerie. The superheroes are eager to help, and we'll start by spreading the word among WasteCon attendees to make Sarah and Susan's presentation standing room only. Excellent news, superheroes! Glad I could help out. Look for this presentation at WasteCon in Long Beach. I knew Valerie was the perfect person to talk to. She knows everything there is to know about WasteCon's presentations. This is a WasteCon session that everyone will want to attend. Superheroes, let's get to work! In keeping with their mission, the SWANA superheroes were able to engage SWANA members to provide details about a solution for a critical waste management issue. Maybe next time, you will be called to help the SWANA superheroes. Will you be ready? For more information about Sarah and Susan's upcoming presentation, join us at WasteCon 2013 in Long Beach, California. Go to www.wastecon.org for registration details. Please share these videos with other concerned citizens and look for the Swana Superheroes on Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn to help them win the WasteCon Challenge. Greetings, citizens. This is the Wizard of Waste again. 
I want to thank you for watching our video and sharing it widely with others in your social networks. The superheroes would like to reward you for your participation in our WasteCon challenge. Just come into the Swana break zone in the exhibit hall and tell the Swana staff member there that the secret code word is greenhouse. The staff member will hand you a fun prize while supplies last. Once again, the secret word is greenhouse. See you at WasteCon where you may get to meet an actual Swana superhero just like me. And cut. That's